it's, it's awesome. Just such an incredible place, isn't it? I mean, I wish I would have been a student here. I mean, it's amazing, isn't it? It's beautiful in Oxford, it's so atmospheric. It's just that golden hue that makes it all feel very rich and timeless. Professor Bagley, Detective Inspector Thursday. Detective Constable Morse, Oxford City Police. We're only here for like three or four days per film. Such a great place because I feel it comes alive as well when you're here. And the way people behave here as well, I think the story starts to make sense in a different way. I'm going away at the weekend. Uh, might not be back for some time. I wonder, could I leave one or two things with you for safekeeping? Of course. It's one of those Cities that you feel like there's secrets hiding everywhere. Little secret areas, you know, where little exchanges can happen. The atmosphere is very important. It's the unseen character, a very pressured environment where no one really says what they're thinking. Everybody's carrying a secret, and everything you do tries to sort of enhance that and that's about the light and the colours and the shots you use. It's to sort of leave you feeling everything is not as it should be, out of kilter. There's lots of lines and perspectives that are arguably psychological, lots of shadow. And it keeps sticking a torch in the lens. It seems like an old-fashioned trick, but it's really effective. It's, it just makes everywhere look so odd and opaque. But also we get to see like the roof of one of the colleges or the underground pastures or somewhere that you wouldn't really necessarily get to see.